G'day everyone. I'm at Bangkok's Hua Lam Fung train station and I'm just about to cap the train down to Hua Hin. Hua Hin is a famous beach town about 200 kilometers south of Bangkok. So the train trip today, for me I'm getting an ordinary train which is going to take about four hours or a bit over four hours. There are special express trains, probably three a day. One leaves at 8.05, another one leaves about 3 and a later one about 10 p.m. So there's a, a good website, thailandtrains.com. So they've got the train schedule, shows you the prices. So let's go check out the train ride to Hua Hin. There is an underground MRT station directly under the station, so you can get public transport here. I got a taxi from Plonshit Road. Uh, Mr. Google said it would take me 20 minutes in the Bangkok peak hour traffic. It took about 30 minutes and cost me just under 100 baht. Let's go check out this station. There's a few food places out the front. Little mini mart, stock up, waffles, sausages on a stick, pork balls on a stick. This is where you buy your ticket, so you can just rock up, buy a ticket for a train today. I think only on the, the special express trains, you can book them on the internet, but they cost about five times the price to buy it on the internet, but it reserves you a seat, and then you can just rock up with your printed out ticket. I think I picked the wrong queue. I've been waiting about five minutes for these people. All right, here we go. Oh, someone else is getting a ticket. Hello. Hey, one ticket, Hua Hin. Today, 9.20. One person. 44 baht. 44 baht, thank you. Cop can drop. Okay, train number you go today. Tam, Bangkok to Hua Hin. Free seat, na? Okay, thank you. Cop can drop. So, 44 baht, that's just over 2 Australian dollars, so a bargain. It's probably the cheapest way to get to Hua Hin. So, I've got more, probably about an hour before the train leaves. So, just a little wander around, there's not much here. There's Dunkin' Donuts, you get some coffee and some donuts. There's a money exchange place, there's a massage place if you want a, like a foot Thai massage. There's a food court through there, so let's go check out what food they've got. Just a small food court. Now, I've already had breakfast, so I don't need any food, but I would like to go grab a coffee. That is a list of all the destinations. So it's all in Thai at the moment, but let's switch to English in a sec. Of course, I was looking at the arrivals board rather than the departure board. So Hua Hin is at 9.20 on platform 7. So they just made, made the announcement to go to the train. So let's go platform 7. my platform 7 and this is my train now this train I believe dates back to the 1980s so almost 40 years old now so another 10 years it'll be a vintage train
จอดเทียนของบรรดาชาติอิมานของคุณค่ะ attention please attention please ค่ะคุณเจ้าจะไปประตูโลวาเองขอความเป็นแอนด์ขอ number eight thank you Looks like all the carts are all ordinary, so no first class, so no air conditioning, windows wide open. Let's get on, see if I can get a seat. It'd be a bitch if I had to stand up the whole way. Alright, pretty hard seats, it's going to be an uncomfortable ride. Got quite a big bag, but it fits up there nicely. Grab a seat next to the window. It has now clicked over to 9.20, so we should be getting on our way, but I'm sure Thai time, that means we could leave at any time, so let's just wait for the doors to close. So, leading on time. Nice work. And away we go. about a train ride is you can get up and stretch your legs.
we are just over halfway. We've been traveling for two hours and ten minutes and two hours and five minutes to go to before we get to Pahin. Now this is the 22nd train station we've stopped at. So out of that two hours and ten minutes, I reckon we've probably spent 30 minutes sitting at train stations. Sometimes we stop for 30 seconds, other times for a few minutes. So 11.30 a.m. Time for me to eat my lunch. and spot on time, so 4 hours and 15 minutes on the train. Now these hard plastic seats are a little bit uncomfortable, but it is nice that you can get up and walk around, stretch your legs. Here we are at Hua Hin. Just got off the train number 1242. So Hua Hin is rated as the most beautiful train station in Thailand. The website Bangkok.com actually has this listed as the number two tourist attraction in Hua Hin. I find that a bit hard to believe. It is a nice station, but I wouldn't go out of my way to come and see the station. I'm sure there's plenty of other attractions. So I've got six nights in Hua Hin. So I've got a lot of traveling around. I'm gonna make some videos, show you some of the best things to do here. So if you're not already subscribed, click on the subscribe button. Click on the little bell button to get the notifications of the new videos. Thanks for watching everyone and happy travels.